like these are uh, in acrylic so you put them onto the wood and, and see still see through and uh, have a look so that the wood oh. really matches in the end. One down here. Oh yeah. I would take uh, the templates and, and look so that you know, see here this is a nice looking part so I would of course not make the body like this because then the nice is outside so of course I would go like right okay here's the bridge here's the pickup so I'll put it like this and then you can see the nice parts in here mm -hmm. so in the next part would be done like this so that it fits together here Right, but like this because then it would not match really. Then we got two halves, so everybody's made of two pieces always, right? That are glued together in the middle. Uh, because of two reasons. First is uh, it's better for us because we save a lot of material, so okay. it's, it's economically very good. And the other reason is if you have a piece of wood as big as, as this, if this would be one piece, um, and the wood is not dry enough, uh, then there will be tensions in the wood and the wood will start moving like this maybe or like this. Right. But if you make it of two pieces and glue them together, it won't happen. The two halves, here, here you still see where the middle line is. So these are already glued together? Yes, they are already glued together. And then you have a very rough part, already looking slightly like a base, a little bit at least. And then we have our friend over here. So we'll... Mr. CNC machine. Exactly. So we'll put this one onto the CNC. Onto the CNC machine. This man is doing all the work, by the way. So the people get to know it. <laughs> <laughs> so here you can see um, the CNC order cuts the outline. Like this. And maybe Hansi takes it off so we can see it. <laughs> Like a base. Yes, it does. So, after we got them like this, of course, uh, there have to be some uh, like this. Yeah, you you can't. You don't, you, you don't want to have your hands on it like this because no. it's very it's very sharp. Right. So the will contours have to be done a little bit round. And that's also done with the CNC? Uh, no. That's done by hand. Right. That's done that's done by hand. Exactly. So that's um, it's always like this. It's always a blend between uh, computer or CNC machine and, and, and wood. Because there is things like curving. We'll see that later when we visit the guy who's doing all the sanding. Hey, I'll not be that in the way. I'm not sure if he's Yeah, he will he will show you every step. Okay.